is a growing trend in today's society to create more positive working environments. Team motivation and mental awareness are paramount in increasing productivity. Here in the office of 104 and SAS management, we have prime examples of incorporating interactive elements within the office. Staff here have access to a bike rack to store their bicycle during the day after they've cycled to work. Staff can also utilize the antique foosball table to blow off some steam, build team rapport, and ensure their businesses are kicking goals. Yes! The open plan office even has a pinball inspired meeting hub. These are just some of the ideas that you can use to boost productivity and interaction within your workplace. Here we are on the sunny Gold Coast, best known for its theme parks, its nightlife, and its beautiful golden beaches. However, if you're looking for something a little bit more low key, yet still very exciting to do while you stay here, why not check out some of the local architecture, like this contemporary home here on Hedges Avenue. To discover these and other cultural delights here on the Gold Coast, head to queenslandtourism.com.au. Hello and welcome to SAS TV. My name is Kate Tuttle. I'm coming to you today from the SAS Management Headquarters here on the Gold Coast. Joining me is National Talent Director, Ryan Verbruggen. Hello, Ryan. Thank you for being with us. It's a pleasure to be in my own office. <laughs> it's great. <laughs> so, Ryan, we're constantly hearing tips and tricks on how to make it in the industry. Mm -hmm. What I'd like to speak to you about is what are your surefire tips to not get any work in the industry? That is a very interesting question, and I'm actually very glad you asked, because I don't think there's enough information out there uh, for the actors and models at home. Uh, how about I share my top five tips? We would love that, wouldn't we? Okay, so number five, I would say, is cut and colour your hair and don't tell your agent. We love to hear surprises. There you have it, mixing it up. What else do you have for us? Uh, number four, I'd have to say, would be... When you're in to answer the audition room, uh, high five the casting director and just yell their name at the top of your lungs. Excitement plus. <laughs> okay, what's next? Uh, number three, uh, make sure you call your agent every day and sometimes multiple times a day because we just love to hear what you've had for breakfast or how your grandma's birthday party was. <laughs> Annoyance is the best way to keep in someone's memory. What else do you have to share with us? Okay, so we're up to number two. Uh, I think the best way is find a red carpet event, you know, whether it be the Logies or maybe the Ari Awards, crash tackle. And I mean, take them out, a celebrity. Um, that, you'll be in magazines and newspapers everywhere. And let's face it, guys, no publicity is bad publicity. Okay, what is your number one tip to not get work? Okay, the number one tip, if, if you have done a bad audition and you're feeling really disheartened, remember, there's always the casting couch. There you have it, straight from the horse's mouth. Thanks for joining us, guys, on SAS TV.